A significant development in forensic science has emerged from Arizona as DNA evidence from a 1994 case has connected one individual to four previously unsolved investigations. Law enforcement officials announced that genetic material preserved from a sexual assault case nearly 30 years ago has now been linked to four separate incidents that had remained unresolved. The individual in question had not previously been connected to these cases, making this discovery particularly noteworthy for investigative teams who've worked on these files for years. The pivotal moment came when advanced DNA analysis techniques were applied to evidence that had been stored since the original 1994 incident. This technological approach allowed forensic specialists to establish connections that were previously impossible to detect, creating a web of linked cases that spans multiple years and locations across Arizona. Supporters praise the persistence of investigators and the power of evolving forensic technology to bring closure to families who have waited decades for answers. Others express concern about the lengthy timeline and question whether earlier technological applications might have prevented additional incidents from occurring. This case highlights a growing trend in criminal justice, where cold case units are revisiting archived evidence with contemporary DNA analysis methods. Similar breakthroughs have occurred nationwide as departments allocate resources to re-examining unsolved cases using genetic genealogy and enhanced testing protocols that weren't available during initial investigations. The significance of this development extends beyond the immediate cases involved as it demonstrates the ongoing evolution of forensic capabilities and their potential impact on historical investigations. With hundreds of thousands of unsolved cases nationwide, this Arizona breakthrough serves as a reminder that time doesn't necessarily diminish the possibility of resolution, and that advances in science continue to provide new pathways for justice even decades after initial incidents occurred.